Hey, what's up? It's Earth Rim Roamer, and I'm out here in uh, Memphis, Tennessee, uh, in a neighborhood called Shelby Forest Fessler, and it's a neighbor. The na it's why Memphis has such a bad reputation. It's this neighborhood that I'm in right now. I actually just entered it, and I'm definitely here. I, w I did some research about this place last night, and God, dude, it's so fucking sketchy out here. Like, um definitely here because the video I watched on this place last night I just passed that place and um, according to damn this dude's fucking riding my ass like he's gonna kill me shit fucking gonna have a drive-by shooting right now so anyways um, this is according to a lot of statistics the most dangerous neighborhood in the United States fuck a dog watch out asshole um, yeah this is the most dangerous neighborhood in fuck dude shit this is like the hood anyways damn there's like so many people aggressively driving by me anyways um according to a lot of uh sources on the internet this is the most dangerous uh, neighborhood in the united states um which is crazy uh still some sources say like the Bronx and New York and the south side of Chicago uh, surpass this place, but a lot of resources say that this neighborhood, Shelby Forest Fessler, is the most dangerous in the United States. Um, and the current uh, statistic for your likelihood of getting robbed just coming through here is a one in seven chance, which is insane. That makes this place more dangerous than anywhere else I've been, Pakistan, India, Iraq in the year 2021 um yeah man um so anyways I'll stop fucking talking for a minute well I don't know about stopping talking but yeah dude all right well, there's not a lot over here damn I wish I'd shown you back there it was just like a complete shithole back there um okay I'm on the main road I'm gonna look for like a neighborhood to go into Better yet, maybe I could find like a group of like gangsters to talk to and hopefully not get shot. Um, or maybe even pull up on a cop and see if he wants to do an interview. Um, I'm keeping my eyes peeled for anything that looks sketchy. <laughs> maybe for your entertainment, I'll get murdered today. Hopefully not. Um, oh, there's a Piggly Wiggly. Yeah, we're definitely in the hood. Uh, I'm entering the first neighborhood. It's a pretty, just a random selection of a neighborhood in this area. Um, yeah, if you want to take a look around. So far, I mean, I see a, I have, while driving on the main road, seen some uh, fucking groups of some ghetto-looking motherfuckers that would fucking beat my ass. So, um, yeah, man, I hope we find, like, a... I heard a lot of the buildings are abandoned, and yeah, well, that's abandoned, that's abandoned. Okay, so I'm trying to be careful who I record, because... You might think I'm up to something, but uh, yeah, this is the third world, bruh. This is the third world USA. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm with my uh, I'm with my new friends out here. Uh, what are you guys' names? Dennis. Uh, uh, Joshua. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you too. Um, so like, what is it like living out here? Is it as bad or as dangerous as they say it is? Or not for me? Not really? for me either. Really? I just think to myself, really. Really? I don't do. Oh, okay. You mind your business. Okay. It, it says, like, on the internet that this uh, neighborhood is, like, in the top three most dangerous in the USA. Mm -hmm. And you, and so you say you don't really, you don't have, like, some crazy shit happening a lot or no? Uh, no? Uh -huh. I just come to school, go home, eat, go to sleep. Do, I don't beat out uh, other people. Do, do you ever... I, I stay with him. I talk to the same people every day. It's just living me. Okay. All right. Um, what else? Do you ever do you hear like consistently about like bad things that happen or not really? Unless I watch the news. Yeah, I'm gonna tell somebody. No. Oh, okay. So it's it's not as bad as they say. For some people, it probably is. Yeah, for some people, depending on who you are. My parents like we don't we ever have stuff like this. My parents either. Okay. All right. Thanks, guys. Right. Okay. So they are demanding that I buy them Takis because I interviewed them. They're like, hey. Let me get a profit. So uh, we're on our way to the nearest gas station to buy them Takis. Okay, the Mapco had no Takis. So uh, 
gonna have to go break the news to them that they won't be getting any Takis today. All right, I'm gonna have to break the bad news to them. Yo, uh, there's no Takis at the Mapco. Yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't even I don't even want to go back now, honestly. <laughs> if hmm, let me think. Let me think. Right. I have pretzels. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye guys. I'm starting to doubt that this could possibly be the most dangerous neighborhood, as they say. Um, I've drove through like Gary uh, in South Chicago before, and I've been to the Bronx. And so far, from what I'm gathering, this is like not as bad as that. <laughs> but yeah, I swear, if I don't find anyone else to interview, yo, shit, yeah, bro. Um, if I don't find anyone else to interview, I'm gonna freaking um, just. Uh, go get some food in Memphis or something because I don't want to just drive around here pointlessly. Okay, since this dangerous neighborhood video is kind of failing on me, I'm trying to find something else cool to do in Memphis, which there's literally nothing. On the border of Arkansas, though, about 15 minutes away, there's a casino because there's no casinos allowed in uh, Tennessee, but in Arkansas they have casinos, so let's see. I'm gonna go gambling and lose some money, and they probably won't let me film inside. Fuck. Well, let's check out a casino. I haven't been to one in years. Before I go leave Memphis, though, I got an interview with a ghetto mattress. Sir, so how much cum have you had jizzed all over you? Good answer. All right, let's get on the highway and uh, get the fuck out of here before I get ra graped. Can't say that word on YouTube. <laughs> All right, let's go. Mirror's Highway. Burp. Yeah, Arkansas. Let's get graped. Oh my God, get it graped. Hey, yeah. All right, we're in downtown Memphis now, about to go into Arkansas, but uh, before we cross over the river, I forgot that Memphis has its own pyramids. Welcome to Cairo, Memphis. There it is, right there. Whoa! Pretty insane. Welcome to Arkansas. Okay, we're at the casino, and damn, it is fucking huge. There's a lot of people here, too. Oh, there's racing, too. There's fucking horse racing here. That's insane. There's no way they're gonna let me film i i doubt it i'll try to sneak this camera in there but they're gonna be like no oh, it's a fucking casino you can't film <laughs> so let's go inside and see what is happening so as you can see the arkansas sign is literally right there and they've literally put the casino right on the line of arkansas since it's illegal to have casinos in tennessee so that's hilarious Half the building is in Tennessee though. <laughs> so that is funny. It's super illegal to film here, but we're at the, uh, the horse racing. There's actual horse racing. But it looks like there's dogs out here running. Try to look at this. I can't zoom in with a GoPro. Do you see the dogs running? Look, it's dog racing. There they are. Run. Okay. All right, I'm getting out of here. It's reeks of cigarettes and alcohol. There's a man screaming right there too. Um. So yeah, uh, not really my scene. It smells of the American dream and depression in there. So, yeah. Uh, I think I'm just gonna head back home probably. Earth Roamer, see you next time.